there is this silence that New Orleans have never been so quiet before. Mm -hmm. You know, you can strum a few notes and they resonate so, they go so far and you hear the echo, it's everywhere. The music just travels so far. People are very hungry for music. <laughs> My name is Anna Rosnowska and uh, I'm a musician. So yeah, I, I used to busk in the quarters and play music. And now I'm doing this project with Sarah. My name is Sarah Grant. I'm almost 38. Uh, what I do for a living, I think that definition has changed quite a bit for a lot of people recently. Um, so right now what I do for a living is take a mobile music box out into New Orleans. Just very suddenly, within about three days, uh, I had lost my job and I had lost prospect of work. In that time of like feeling a lot of emotion and crisis, there just like felt a very strong call to like you need to find meaning and purpose somewhere somehow still. And I love pedicabbing. I'm very passionate about it actually and very passionate about people. I think it's so important to have meaningful moments with strangers. And Anna's a beautiful musician. We've been good friends for a while. So I just said one day, um, you know, I would be like, yeah, we need to go around on the pedicab while you play violin in the city and just give that. There wasn't a big plan for what it would look like or that we, you know, we decided to put things that people wanted to tip on the side, but um, it wasn't like we're going to do this to achieve, you know, these different objectives and this is what it's going to look like and how it's going to be next week, but just something that we both really felt we like needed and wanted to do for ourselves and for the city. Oh, absolutely, absolutely. Thank you for being people to do it for. We'll, we'll be out till we can't be anymore. It's beautiful. Mm -hmm. It's very beautiful what mm -hmm. happens. And I say like, you know, with music and with what we do, I always say you cannot push nobody to listen to your music. They have to want it themselves. They have to make themselves hey, available. How you, doing? you know, I play on the streets and I know how this is a very different thing because there are days when people are really unavailable. You can play the most beautiful song and people just walk by, ah, it's nice, what, what's next, you know? This is very different audience right now. The mm. people are very present and it's not about me, it's about them. It's about how they show up for themselves, how they cherish that moment, that minute or two where we pass by that they give to themselves that can inspire them or help them to transform difficult feelings, emotion, mm -hmm. whatever. It's, mm -hmm. a spar it's, a, it's a sparkle that mm -hmm. we can bring. That's nothing more that we can in this moment, but I feel it's just a very big thing for people right now. <laughs>